Resident Evil 4 in HD. Playing on the Xbox or on Chapter 2 1. Okay, we just went across the lake and uh, got some treasure, got the gem, uh, some good stuff to loot over there by the merchant. Uh, <clears throat> upgraded my shotgun, got the capacity up to 10 rounds. Uh, with that shotgun, I'm not doing any other upgrades, but just uh, the capacity just uh, saves on some rounds. You're going to use it anyway, but uh, you get through the door. This is the first time you come across the heads that turn into whatever you want to call it here. You got one that kind of has like a parasite that comes out of the top of his head, and then you got this one with the squiggly uh, razor blade thing that likes to come out at you. Definitely where the sniper rifle is nice at a distance, one shot, and these, <coughs> these guys are down. Pay out some nice gold. I don't remember if that guy like throws an axe at you or dynamite or whatever, but I figured I'd just take him down before I took the rope down. Okay, when you get up here to the switch, it's going to checkpoint right there. So if you uh, get killed, it'll just start you right back here at this switch. Okay, my uh, plan was to flashbang these guys, the enemies that are coming at me after the cinematic, and then uh, get up this ladder, but I don't think it works out well for me.
try a fire grenade. I don't know if that's going to help. didn't go as well as I was hoping. Yeah, it's like I better eat something. I take one uh, flying hatchet here or whatever I'm done for. The reason why I uh, do this is just uh, it's a good way to conserve ammo. There's definitely plenty of fight coming up where I'm going to need the ammo, so any chance you can get by getting them to come up a ladder and just knifing them, it's always a good thing. Got a piece of treasure here. Okay, there's the insignia for the church. I've obtained an object that resembles a cult group's insignia. Wonderful, Leon. Head back to the church. Ashley's safety is our immediate priority. Okay, we take the little boat ride over to the merchant area, and then we're going to save the game. And once we get back to the next video, we're going to be dealing with the first giant that we come across. And that dog that we helped in the beginning of the game will come and give us a hand. So we'll see you on the next one. Double A Gamer for Life.